All right, I'm here to answer your questions. Wow. Wow. We're off to a really good start, guys. I don't know what that is. Actually, only a small percentage of furries actually own fursuits. They're really expensive and it gets super hot. I won't deny that there are some people in the furry fandom who see it like that and do all these crazy things, but, you know, everything has a Rule 34 side and furries are no exception. Furries pretty much do the same as people who aren't furries do. I mean, minus, minus the, the animal parts, we're, we're all the same, you know? You're looking at him. I really can't stand when I text somebody and I see that they read it, but they take forever to respond. It really gets on my nerves. I don't hate it, I just don't particularly like it. If I say something, you will listen to me, and you're not going to be like, cool story, bro, because you know what the cool story is going to be? When I'm on the 5 o'clock news for straight up murdering your ass. It's like, what are you doing? Um, I don't think so. Uh, I mean, I don't really know what bronies do, so you're asking the wrong person. 42. Mm, uh, that's a tough one. Um, there's so many good ones. But, you know, if, if I had to pick one, it'd probably be Expelliarmus, because um, I could use it to disarm my opponent and attack them before they can get their weapon back. And if they didn't have a weapon, I can just use Expelliarmus to throw them across the room. It's a pretty useful spell. And that's all you guys' questions. You know, um, feel free to ask more in the comments. I might make another Q&A video soon. Um, bye.